think of how unsafe women are in the country five years post the Nirbhaya incident. There is another shocker there coming in from Jammu. Yes, you're absolutely right. Even after seven decades of independence, we have failed to ensure the safety and security of the women in the country. And here it's a very shocking and a shameful incident where a minor girl was, uh, her out, uh, modesty was outraged by a teacher and she had been a student of the high school in Padan area in Kishwa district. And this man had been her teacher from class one till eight. Now this girl had moved to the high school and she was a student of 10th standard. And this teacher, where two days back, she had gone to attend one of the marriage party. This teacher called her out. She had no idea and inkling because no one can suspect that ever a teacher who's like a mentor, a godfather, a father figure to the students can ever indulge in such an ugly and uh, criminal activity. And uh, he took her to the nearby hotel where he outraged her modesty. She went home and revealed the whole in fact, ordeal and the trauma she had to go through to her family members and filing the case. But what is more shocking is that in such cases often we have seen that the village uh, community members, the sarpanches and the punches, they try to hush up the matter. Exactly the same thing happened here in this case also. They tried to hush up the matter. They wanted that the girl should be married to the one who raped her, outraged her modesty, not realizing the trauma she must have gone through. And this man has got four kids. He's already married. And one of the daughters of this uh, teacher is in fact elder to the, the student he raped. So how come, in fact, the punch and the serpent can really think of marrying this girl to the person who had raped and outraged her modesty? And it was, in fact, the superintendent of the police who got the whip of the whole uh, thing. And he immediately asked the SHO to rush to the spot and register an FI. Right now, the search is on. The manhunt is launched, in fact, to apprehend this culprit teacher. Because this is not uh, a good thing to happen. Because how uh, this is like just a black spot on the education system. Everybody thinks that the teacher is like a parent who is taking care of their kids. But here in this case, he is calling a student who is in fact attending the marriage party. Even the family members could never suspect that what actually his intentions are. When the girl came out, he took her to the nearby hotel where outrage the modesty. And for two days, this girl was kept captive in that hotel where she had to face that kind of a problem. So right now the police have registered a case, Manhattan is on, and they are looking for this man, and they're hopeful that within 24 hours they will be able to arrest this culprit teacher. All right, Pradeep, many thanks for getting us those details there. Uh, Pradeep, of course, saying that the manhunt to nab the culprit is on, and the accused, of course, is a former teacher, uh, is married and has four kids. Currently, a case has also been registered. Moving on now from that story, after 